Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for Andrew K. I can't believe this family has grown that much that fast. So as you know, we are currently in quarantine, but I really miss my friends. So I bought this giant inflatable bubble on Amazon and I let Mason test it out and he said it worked great. So I'm going to get in this bubble and I'm going to live in it for 24 hours and hopefully I can walk over to Brent's in my bubble and hang out with him and Lexi and it'll be safe. If you're excited to see me live in a bubble for 24 hours, give this video a big thumbs up and let's get me in the bubble. Okay. So it is currently 9 15 in the morning, which means I have until 9 15 the next day to be living in this bubble. So we're gonna inflate it right now. I'm gonna get in it and we're gonna start our day. All right, so I called Ben and he's gonna help me out. He's gonna help me inflate the bubble because this is a two-man job. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Should we play soccer? <laughs> Dude, look at her hair. It's freaking spiking up. I can feel the static like in the air. Okay. Translate what Lexi just said. Probably can't hear. She said she's gonna walk over to Brent and Lexi's house and then try to go in their pool and hang out with them in the bubble. All right, so Lexi's attempting to walk. But now she's running. I honestly don't know how easy this is. It does not look that easy. Quarantine has people going crazy, I swear. You look crazy. I can't believe this right now. The ball fits perfectly in this walkway. Oh my God. Lexi looks like one human sized hamster in this ball. I've never seen anything like it. Okay, guys, so I'm in the bubble right now. Like, you can't, you can't really tell. Bubble and I have claustrophobia and it's not like super severe, but I do have claustrophobia and I like, get anxious in small spaces. It's super hot in here. It's really challenging. <laughs> so I guess today I'm gonna get over my claustrophobia here. Oh no, a car's coming. A car's coming. Wait, Lexi, move. There's a car. There's a car. She can't hear me. He's taking a picture. <laughs> All right, normally this gate only opens for cars. We'll see if it opens for Lexi. Just run at the gate. She has to run at it. It might open. Is it gonna open? Oh my God, the gate opened. Normally it never opens for people, but I guess it opens for a hamster ball. No way that just worked. All right, Lexi's on her way to uh, Brent and Lexi's house. Guys, if Lexi got hit by a car right now, she'd just go flying, honestly. Guys, everyone's just watching Lexi. This is quite the scene. <laughs> Guys, this random. <laughs> We're pushing Lexi down the hill now. <laughs> <laughs> no way. This random guy is pushing Lexi down the hill. This is so funny. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> Guys, it's steamy in there. It's uh, It says 10, 19. It's been an hour since Lexi's been in the ball. 23 more hours, I guess. All right, we're finally pulling up to Brenda Lexi's. She's saying it's super duper hot. <laughs> Such a bad idea. Hey, there's Brett. <laughs> After a lot of struggle, we finally made it to Brent's backyard. Lexi's gonna hop into the pool, I think, right? Oh no. <laughs> How does it feel? It's fun. Yeah, Lexi. <laughs> Apparently, there's a leak in the ball. We finally fixed the hole with some red duct tape. That took a lot of running back and forth. What? How's it going? Oh no. Well, how, how is there a hole? She's Come here. Like she's having a lot of fun, doesn't it? Here, wait, can I push you off? Yeah. Okay, come here. Okay. Are you ready? Should I like body check it? Three, two, one. So it has been a couple hours. Lexi's gonna post made us food because we're starving. What are you getting? Um, can you can you get me Taco Bell? Taco Bell? Wait, I thought I thought you were ordering it. Order it on your phone and I'll pay you. Oh, you want me to order it? Wait, do you want something? Yeah. I can't hear you. What? Yeah, I want. Yeah. So Lexi, I'm gonna get Taco Bell, but do you want anything? Yes or no? Because yeah, I'm ordering nacho it. Fries. You want what? Nacho fries. Nacho. Wait, I I, I nothing. Nacho. 
Okay, all right, that's fine. I'll, I'll get you nothing. Sheesh. All right, our food. I mean, my food's coming. I couldn't hear you, so you don't get anything. All right, guys. So Brent did just order from Postmates, but I want to tip the Postmates lady a hundred dollars in cash because she's working during such a crazy time right now, and things are really uncertain. So I thought that'd be a really nice thing to do for her. So I'm gonna have Bryson get the hundred dollars out of my wallet right now and just get it ready for her. Hi. Thank you so much. We just wanted to thank you so much. Oh, thank you oh, so oh much. Gosh, Be you. safe. Yes, we appreciate you. you so much. You too. All right, Lexi, we got you a Baja Blast from Taco Bell. She's been in there for so long. I bet it's so hot. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Lexi finally has some type of food or drink in there after a few hours. <laughs> How does it taste? It's so good. I'm so thirsty. It's hot in here. The Postmates driver was so happy to see that we gave her $100, by the way. She was so sweet, yeah. Okay, so Bryce and I are going to try to pass some time by playing Heads Up, the charade game on his phone. And hopefully that will make the time go by faster. Lexi's currently sunbathing. She says she's enjoying herself. All right, guys, it's a lot later here. The sun's kind of going down slowly. We are bored out of our minds. Lexi and I have literally been Snapchatting each other from like, I'm literally sitting on this and she's in the ball. We don't know what to do. Should we do yoga? Oh yeah, let's do yoga. <laughs> down for doggy. <laughs> Day 13 of quarantine. We don't know what we're doing. It's really cold now. I feel on my jacket. Do you want me to get it for you? Yeah, can you get me all my stuff? I have like a pillow, a blanket. So Lexi has her pillow, her cozy blanket, and her sweater. So Lexi's all bundled up in there. We have nothing to do. I decided that we should play Never Have I Ever. So I'm gonna give her Never Have I Ever's and we'll see how many fingers go down. Never have I ever got into a car accident. Never have I ever had to stay in a ball for 24 hours. <laughs> Never have I ever cheated on a test. <gasps> Lexi! Maybe, we, maybe playing this game was a bad idea. <laughs> Never have I stalked an ex on social media. <laughs> Lexi, you're scaring me. I think we've given up on the game and she's gonna go to sleep. Look who came to hang out with me. You wanna film some TikToks? Yes. All right, so we are going to be making a TikTok to I'm a savage. Okay, timer is on. Three seconds on the clock. <laughs> this is so funny. <laughs> All right. Do you guys wanna see the final TikTok? <laughs> this is so funny. So the sun's slowly making its way past the horizon, but uh, I think Lexi's gonna spend the night in the pool. Sleeping in a bubble on water. This is really comfortable. It's literally just a water bed if you think about it. It's actually kind of soothing me to sleep. So I also packed some face makeup removing wipes so that I can take off my makeup and I don't have to sleep with it on. Quick, 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 quick. <laughs> Yay! Okay, so I'm in my bubble. It's dark now, and I'm honestly ready to like watch some Netflix on my phone and go to bed. So I'm just gonna take off my makeup. It's really funny because Brett and Lexi are inside right now, like just chilling, making dinner, and I'm just out here like can't get off my makeup in a bubble. But yeah, while I'm doing this, I'm just gonna like recap for the day. Um, this challenge has honestly been interesting. Like it started out really hard. It was super, super hot, and I was like not sure that I could do this challenge, and I was feeling really claustrophobic because of how hot it was and I was scared and yeah I really didn't know if I was gonna be able to do it but once we like got to Brent's like that was the hardest part was like walking all the way here in the bubble and like getting overheated but once we got to Brent and I got in the pool like it was nice and cool and things got a lot easier. All right guys so um it is late it is my bedtime hopefully I can sleep tonight I think I'll be fine the only thing I'm worried about is like there was a hole that we patched up but I'm just worried like if there's another hole and I wake up to like thinking in the middle of the night, but hopefully that doesn't happen. I think I'm just gonna like scroll on TikTok and like try to fall asleep now, but I will see you guys in the morning. Bye. All right guys, welcome back. It is currently the next day here. So I did check up on Lexi earlier. Um, I found her on this thing <laughs> and she did oversleep, but it is currently 10 a.m. Lexi, your challenge is over, hun. <laughs> yeah. Yes, it's, you're, it's literally 10 a.m. How was it? Was it sketch last night? Do you need help? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Come out. Oh my gosh. That feels so 
so good. I haven't felt like fresh air in a minute. <laughs> Welcome back to the oh new world. Gosh. Dude, that was sketch. I kept like, I slept pretty good, but I kept waking up because like water was getting in. Really? So, like, there were a couple like holes, but I couldn't find them because they were small. So I like went on that thing at like 5 a.m. That was a good idea. It like held me in place, mm -hmm. but that was a really hard challenge. Oh my God. <laughs> Peace out to my home for the last 24 hours. Wow, beautiful. Wow. All right, um, that was a hard challenge, <laughs> but it was really fun and I'm glad I got to hang out with my friend. I'm gonna link everyone down below. Make sure you follow them if you're not already. Thank you guys so much for watching. I can't wait to brush my teeth and eat some food and like just do normal things not in a bubble. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next Sunday. Bye.